points. We left off with the main character, Jinan. I'm really... On the Tenshu Ga Tachi Domaru Mata Koka O Narashi Tara Usugurai Tenai Ni Sono Otoga Okiku Hibi he be that he be it. Uh, the store lady she came to a stop, and I, when I made the coin make sound one more time, uh, the that sound, it echo loudly in the dark room, in the dim room, in the right. dim store. On the tenshu wa unazuita, the store lady nodded. Ma, kane ga aru nara isa. Well. If you have money, then it's okay. Um, so stay. Ah, atsude no zubon to kutsu shita de kasugiru koto ni au shatsu ke ito no. Mafra to boshio itotsu zutsu sakashite kita. And afterward, I came to find one at a time the hat uh the and the scarf made of wool, shirts that matches with the coat that is too, that is uh, too big or extra large and uh, socks and pants that are thick. Perfect. Ore wa kutsumo Um Sagateyo To Koe o kaketa. I made the sound. I begin to voice that. Uh, let's search for socks for shoes as well. Search for shoes as well. Hi, shoes. Good. Um. Hayaku. Arukeru ganjo na kutsu ga i. It would be good. Uh, it's good uh, that it's a shoe that it's sturdy and able to walk quickly. So sereba. If I to if I were to do that, nobody ni okurezu ni okurezu is without being late. Right. Or another word. Not I will behind. not fall behind. 
ナブリスイタイケル。And I will be able to stick with him. Make parody with I m e a n I s w e e t that as in attached to him. I get it. I'm able to. Um, on the tension, got ne, ne dan o ita. The store lady told me the price. Or she spoke the price. Nebari to ni. I'm sorry, no, it's Benetto ni. Hayaku shiro to i ware de ita kara. Because Benet had told me to quickly do it,、uh, do it quickly. Negira.、Uh, There's no time to bargain. I ware da kin gaku o sasato harai. I immediately pay the price that I was told. Boro fuku ga Boro fuku kara Atsude no fuku ni Kika ete. I changed from worn out clothes into thick clothing. Kutsu himo o shime. I tie the shoestrings and kata bakari no koto no pocketoni into the pocket of the coat that I have just bought. Naifu to chom mae yabari no yaburi no. Hari gane o sukomu to. I stuff into, I insert into,、uh, or I insert the lockpick. The lock, the lock, the, the lock, I thrust the lockpick wires and the knife into my pocket. To. I, into my pocket. He s a w that quickly. Mise o tobi dashta. I dashes out. Perfect. Of the store. Uh, so, so that waiting. So, so that. What that? What that? Waiting outside, Ita was Benet Toa. Waiting outside was Benet. Um, Miru Kara Ni. From what I can see, or From, from that which is visible, Ira Suite Tai. He was Ira Suite. He was annoyed. So then he shit them all. Even, even so, even, even though that was so, Fukuga Atarashi. To ah, he been got garato kawaru mono da
uh, because of new clothes, not because of new clothes. Pulp here with a strong condition, or it's a strong quote, I'm guessing. Well, how would you be quoting that? Is there like you here? No, you. So Aye. this is just a talk. Yep. So toll is has only two ways you can translate it. It's either going to be translated as when or if, right? This is the to that goes between two clauses. Hence, atarashi, which is a adjective. If to goes after a noun, then it can mean and. And you tend to get that confused. You tend to translate to as and, but it's when or if. The thing is, there's no there's no when or if word in Japanese. It's just you know they separate it into different categories, right? So to and tara and reba are all when ifs, and you just need context to know if it's when or if it's if. So to in this is, is almost always translated as when because it has that 100% probability thing. So it feels more like when this happens, this happens. Versus if feels a little bit vaguer in English, but you could you could translate it as if if you wanted to. Um, but in general, when tends to be the choice to use with to. Hey, fuku ga atarashi to. When there's new clothing. Uh, when the clothing is new. Fuku ga. Kibun ga the feeling. The mood. Garato. One eighty, or completely. Kawaru. Uh, it changes. Monoda. It is so. Yep. You can either say it changes completely, or my mood does a one eighty. My mood does a one eighty would be an example of a very English way to translate the sentence. Um, my mood changes completely would be a literal translation. Not only that it is not cold. Samukunai Furochi no Kako Tata Tokiwa. Kibun mo chirochi de Oso ga ri Ku no, not Kura gari Kura gari o Koso koso to ukoki Mawatte wakari da Um, when Toki the time that I was outfitted uh, as a vagrant as a street kid Kako is an outfit, Raimani, an appearance. Hi, it's all everything to do with your uh, appearance. The time that my appearance was that of a street kid, my mood also was that of a street kid. And Koso Koso To. Ugoki I move around Ugoki Mawat Bakari Ita I the I did nothing but or it no that he he didn't say I did nothing but he said there was nothing but Moving around sneakily in the in the darkness. 
there was nothing but moving around sneakily in the darkness. Demo, chanto shita fuku o itara. But when I am wearing clothes that are proper, he no takai chikang ni ara ki mawate mo. Bikutsu kanai. Bikutsu kanai is not afraid. Right. What is a walk so, again in Japanese? Sorry, what's a walk again walk. in Japanese? Aru. Aru. Is to walk. Aru ki mawate. Even when I was walking around during. The daylight, he no takai chikang. I, there was no fear. Perfect. He no takai chikang is daylight. Uh, specifically, it's like broad daylight. It's that prime daytime, right? It's when the sun is at its highest. So theoretically, Daylight could be like 8 a.m. in the morning, but broad daylight is not till like 11 a.m., right? That's when most people are awake. Hi. Shikamo. Ima no ore wa majutsu shi. No, there she da. Morning. What is more in Shika? Oh, no. But more than that. All right, on top of that. On top of that. Shika is not only, but more. Shika mo. Uh, ima no ore wa. I am now. I now is a maho jutsu shida shida, an apprentice magician. Perfect. The netto kara wata sareta doka ga ichimai amata no de. Yami ichi hiroba de yatai ni tachi yori so se chi o hasanda muffin o kate nusunde Nusunda Janaka Janto Kata Ndazo Veneto O Hashite Oi Kake Taberu To Sashida Shita Beneto kara watasareta do kaga. The coin which I received from Benet. Ichimai amata no de because there's extra left. How much extra? Ichimai one extra left. Yami ichihiro bade at the Plaza of the night market. I tachi yori. I stand next to the booth. The booth. Uh, yatai ni. And I 
sosechi o hasanda muffin o katte. I bought a muffin that was stuffed with sausage. Nusunda nja naka. I did not steal it without the one I. Without stealing it. And and chanto kata nda so I bought it properly. Benetto o hashite. Oi kake, I ran and caught up to Bennett. Taberu to I say uh, Do you want to eat? Taberu, eat? Sashi dashita. Hi, will you eat? And eat? I present. Mm -hmm. I, I present for you. Um, can you read this example sentence for me? Veneto wa itsumo no yo ni mucho um mu mio hiyo jo hiyo jo da. So you think it's he yo or do you think it's Hyo. He, yo. Hyo. Hyo. It's hyo. No yo. he. Hyo. Throw that e in the garbage where it belongs. Don't say e in Japanese. Yo, yoda, yoda, yoda. Hyo. Yoda. 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 Yo. 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 Non expression, unexpressioned. Hey. What does it um, mean altogether? Benetto wa suimo. Itsumo always. Yoni. Benet is unexpressive as always. Perfect. Can you read this word for me? Mu shi. Perfect. Mushi Mu is ignore. And it is a noun. Ignore. So a lot of times you add sudu to it. So it started with mu. What did it end with? Mu shi. Perfect. Can you read this example sentence for me? Yo jinbo wa. Dorobo o mushishita. The bodyguard ignored the thief. Perfect. The body ignored the thief. You know what chao means? Chao. Chao. Chimao. Chimao is I finished it. It could be used to mean that, not super commonly, but that is the um, official translation of the word. Um, what is the actual meaning of this word normally? He say taberare chimao. Oops, I did it. So oops is also not really <laughs> right, but you do have the right emotion idea for it. So here, there's no oops going on, but it is showing a sadness, right? He's unhappy about the idea of taberaru, of being eaten, something, specifically the bacon. It's not, oops, I ate all the bacon. It's, oh no, they're going to eat all the bacon, right? So, chao could be kind of used with 
Oops. Um, not really, well, but I mean, we, we could. Yeah. Are we insinuating a future tense? Are we insinuating that it will be eaten? As you can see down here, it's chimau, which is dictionary form. Dictionary form so... is future tense. If it had already eaten, it'd be in past tense form, right? Like, shimatta. Right? Or here would be, uh, shimatta. Right? That would be past tense. So, always good to keep an eye on the tensing for things. So, this is either, so this is the, the idea is that this is like kind of currently happening or will be happening soon. Like, they're going to completely eat up the bacon, you know, with it, like, happening Hi. kind of right now-ish type of idea. As if they haven't fully eaten the bacon yet when this is used. Otherwise, it'd be past tense. Hi. What is the passive form to be ignored? The passive form to be ignored is mushi. Mushi. Mushi, um, Mushi, uh, uh, Mushi, she that te form. No, no, passive. Mushi, 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 Passive, no. Mushi sareru. Right. Mushi sareru, which would be mushi sareta in past tense. Perfect. Um, can you read this word right here for me? Uh, shin, shinbai, shinbai yep, da. Shinbai worried. So let's go read the lines in the book. Uh, it's a zenbu te taberare shimao tara. どうしよう。と、ちょ、ビリ心配だったけど、ベネットに、ベネットにはいつものように無視された。全部、全部 who is going to Zembu Tabarare Chimao? Con Benetto? Zen Zenbu Tabarare Chimatara do Shima do Shio. Doshio, what will I do when? What will I do when he ate it up? Yes. When he finished. So in this context, we could translate with when, but if makes more sense. It is just annoying about English that we separate the words. So if he completely eats all of it, what am I going to do? To to pity. What am I going to do? Um, uh, oh, one second, Mark. Sorry. Cho, to, cho, 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 biri. Cho, biri. Yeah. So, beauty so means exactly what you think it means. It's, it's exactly what it sounds like. Chopi, chopi, chopi. Like chotto and choito, right? All the same thing. Chopi, simpai data. I was afraid. Worried. I, I was worried. How worried? Was he really worried? He's super duper worried. No, no, he was uh, a little bit worried. Yeah, 
He was a little bit um, worried about what? He was a little bit well, kiddo. However, he was a little bit, he was worried that, uh, what would I do when he finished the food? When he finished all of it? Yeah. What would I do if he exactly. eats up all the food? What would I do if Bennett, when he offers him the food, will eat it all up? That kiddo. I mean, kiddo. Not kiddo. Uh, however, Bonetto ni wa itsumo no yo ni. He always, as a mushi uh, sarita, he always ignored me. As always. Yep, he ignored me like he does always. Sarita. I was ignored by Bonet like always. So there was no need for me to be worried about him eating up my um, sausage with my muffin with sausage. Um, can you read uh, this word for me? I think we've seen it in this in the past, maybe, maybe not. Shina, shina, shina. You're right. It is going to be Shina twice. Do you think this has rendaku or doesn't have rendaku? It will have rendaku. Shina, jina. Perfect. Which means things and goods. So, hotto shinai is kind of the opposite of hatto shita. So, hatto suru is to be like surprised. And hatto shinai means to not be surprised. Specifically, to be kind of like underwhelmed. Kind of idea. Patto shinai. I did not even go. <gasps> is the kind of idea of it. Um. So underwhelming. Can you read this example sentence for me? Patto shinai. Shina china wa. Yasui. The things, the goods, was um unsurprisingly cheap. Hmm, that's a really interesting guess. Why can it not be this grammatically? Why is that wrong grammatically? My hint was the Lee. Uh, and, uh, okay, so. Shina Jina was, was modified with Pato Shinai. So the good that was... um average that right. was uh, not amazing there was nothing but cool those in the goods. Nice. those those kind of like saying cheap. it's junk so, right sub- <laughs> right exactly that's right. what it it's says. like the sub the sub standard or the sub right. par so uh, if you want to do the thing you said up. earlier you have to do the coup here but those inside um Yasui, which is um, unsurprisingly cheap, but it's it's more like underwhelmed than like surprised. So this word, so earlier we saw um, yaten, right? Which was one of these things, but specifically, theoretically, it refers to the kind with wheels. This is the word that refers to the kind like just the normal boots. Um, do you know how to say this word? It's roten. Hi, so roten starts with ro, which is kind of funny. It has a little rain right here, and we have someone standing here to go um, serve customers. Little feet right there, and then we have a kyaksama coming over to get something from them. Roten. Um, ended with ten. That, that ro, well, that ro by itself. What does that mean? The kanji. I... Do you know? Don't know. It looks is like, like rain, a lot of other kinds. Rains and has rain radical, the chaksama radical. And then it of... am I? Oh, no. Um ro is to you, which means um do or not at all. So um like a open air bath is a ro ten buro with ten from tenkoku. Not ten from uh, Nisei. That would be. 
So I guess it, it's but kind of comes from the idea of explode, ex, ex, exposure, like you get do over everything. Yeah, it is a new word. It's also used for like the Japanese word for Russia, which is kind of funny. Because like English is rice country, Russia is do country. Oh, okay. What is this do? Uh, I think it's just the sound. It's like a ro, as in rosa, rosu, or rosa, ros. Probably. Perfect. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it is so, to you I mean, on its own, which means do, um, which is that, you know, that water from first thing. You, in uh, one. like the water. Hi. Hi. Ro, ro. Uh, that's why the, that's why the ame on the top. So, so, so. Um, so, roten, okay. roten no, to, hi. So here it say futari de uh, yami ichi hiroba no ya tai ya roten no po to. No, that is not po, that is pa. Pa to shinai shina jina o mite mawata. The two of them look one more time. Look around. No, look around for, uh, at, at merchandise that are subpar in the booth and in the uh wheel in 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 the wheel cart, sort of um in the in the uh, movable booth. In the movable store and in the booth um, at the uh, plaza of the night market. Perfect. And you can see here that this right here theoretically is modifying both yatai and Ryoten since it's in that first kind of thing after and. Pretty common for this kind of to happen while well, these will share stuff. Which I vaguely told you last time about the wool, how they specifically got a wool, a wool scarf and hat. The hat may or may not be wool. It's like uh, it could be wool, could not be wool. It is fifty-fifty kind of idea. So that's another example of that where contact with you know, yeah, both of those things. Um, you know what this word is? That's no. Perfect. How about this word, which is like oneself or body? Uh, Michi? No. Chin. Uh, hi, it can be read as that. No. In this case, it is read as mi. Or wareru mi. Um, mi. But it is read like that, like uh, dishin. It's in that word somewhere. Um, so it does have that jin kind of idea. But yeah, mi is how. This is red. What does me mean? Me mean body. Perfect. One body, one old body specifically. Right. So this word refers to a shawl, which is a pretty random word for it. Can you read it for me? Katakake. Hi. So literally it is a, basically have something on your shoulders. So a, a shawl, you know, is like you know kind of kind of like a little cape like thing right kind of like in between a it's between a scarf and a cape that's what a shawl is so, um can you read this for me Hi. um tsutsumi perfect uh what does it mean tsutsumi that's it that's it twice what is Tsutsumi mean? is to wrap. Perfect. Take off. To wrap something. Right. What's this guy right here? Uh, this guy. It's uh, me. Me. Perfect. Can you read this example sentence for me? 
天使の天使は肩掛けに身を包んだ。I wrap my body with a shawl. Hi, who wraps their body? The owner. Perfect. And she. Um, do you know what a jacket is? Kakia, the customer. Perfect. And of course, this is a kanji that you are going to be forced to know because it's super common in Japanese. Jacket. Um, can you read this example sentence for me? It's kaimono. Jacket ga doko ni. Perfect. So, kaimon no kyaku is actually a compound word, but the meaning I think you would know. I think you know what this means. Kaimon no kyaku. Kaimon no kyaku is the customer. What kind of customer? Does a customer that goes to a massage parlor? It's a Kaimono. hotel custom, a, a person that goes to a hotel, that customer? Kaimono. Someone customer. vacationing somewhere, customer? An air, someone shopping. going on the airplane? Yeah, it's a shopper. It's a shopper, hi. Specifically, it's a Kaimono. customer that does, that gets kaimono. Shop, it is a shopper. Kaimono suru is to go shopping, right, money? Kaimono suru. Yeah, or you say kaini suru, probably either. To go to shop, go shopping. Kaimono kaimono are, are um, what is kaimono by itself mean again? Kaimono well, by kai itself means comes from that cow. You saw cow a lot today. Cow <laughs> to buy. Now, when you take cow and you put it into stem form, you get kai, right? Because kau and u becomes kaimas, right? So kai. Mono is thing. So you can go kamehara together to make kaimono, which means a thing that you buy. Just like taberu is to eat, and tabemono is a thing to, that can be eaten. They're both nouns that just mean a shoppable item, a eatable item, basically. Food. Um, shopping item. Uh, purchase uh, goods. So here it is. Kaimono. Kaimono. Um, kaimono. Kyo. 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 Ga. Doko ni. Moinai. Moinai. Doko ni. Moinai. Toko ni where tokos where moinai uh even to where it is not there is not a customer anywhere. Exactly. There are no customers anywhere. Perfect. Of course this is a hyperbole, but would definitely be used. There's no, but there's no shoppers here. There's no place where there are shoppers. The contact would be here. Can you read this bolted section for me? Okano shu. Tama. Tama. Shu is very similar. You're talking about tenshu no shu. Here it is. As you can see, the difference is that this little dot is at the top, and this little dot is down here. So, tama. You know what tama means? Tama, tama. He said the remaining sphere. Yes, the, the remaining other ball. Balls. The other, the whole ball. Um. The other Jira, hora, is a adverb, so a lot of times it's used with to, 
That means here and there, like sporadically about. Chira hora. Can you read this example sentence for me? Chira. Here and there. Kata kake o mi o susunda kyaku ga chichi hora iru. Here and there, there, uh, there are uh, a customer that wraps themselves with shawls. Perfect. Um, can you read this bolded line? Oka no ga rakuta. Toi shoni. Rakuta. Something of the or something. Gorakta is a noun, hence, um, hence the to here meaning and or with in this context. An example of something gora, that'd be garakuta, I would say it's something that you would, um, pato sinai mono. Things that you pato sinai are probably garakuta. Average. Pato shimai is like underwhelming. It's so you can translate it as average, but you might instead, if you wanted to say average, you would probably use a different word like dimina or um, or, or something. Pato um, shimai basically me. It's like um, if you've ever heard of that one lady that was on like Netflix for a while, like she's like, does this spark joy? That lady, that's her, like, does this make you go, pa? <laughs> Doesn't say that, but that's what she's saying. Does it spark joy? So it's something that does not spark joy. It is uninteresting and it's underwhelming. If something is normal, that's not really underwhelming. Normal is normal. It's it, underwhelming is below normal, right? If you're eating food and it's normal, then you're pretty happy with it. But if you bought some food and you said it was underwhelming, that means you actually were upset, right? You didn't actually like it. Like it wasn't like poisonous and you could eat it, I guess, but you were not happy with what you got, right? If you describe, if you went to Disneyland and you describe the experience as underwhelming, that is a really bad thing to say, right? Versus if you describe it as average or normal, I would instead insinuate if it's average and normal that you probably have gone to many different theme parks and it's average among the theme parks. So average in itself is not negative, but pato is, is negative, right? If something is underwhelming, that is means it is just it's like boring versus normal, which are related but are pretty different, I feel like, right? Um, but garakuta means junk. Junk. Junk is something that does not spark joy. Um, what is hokami? Hoka no garakuta. The other junks. Perfect, the other junk. Nice. So, let's go read the line from the book. Garakuta. Moni, Garaku actually had a kanji, isn't it? Yeah. Garakuta. Right, right here. This is the kanji for Garakuta. It is I fun a lot. And it's actually mean junk. Yes. It's a, it's a lot as in quantity, like oi. Garakuta. Garakuta. Right. Ga from waga. Raku from easy and ta. <laughs> Sorry, I was like, what was that? I was like, what was the last country? Yep. Garakuta. Hi. Um, I can read this line from the book. Boro fuku to kata kake ni mio susunda kaimono kyaku ga 
Okani Mo Chira Orai Perfect. So what's going on here is a little bit weird. Um, I know when I read this, I was like a little bit confused when I first read the sentence. But the Hokani Mo is saying on top of their iruing a kaimono kyaku that is described as this, there are other kaimono kyaku that are maybe not wearing this exact same ensemble clothing. So it's this guy as well as others are chirahora. Here and there. Chirahora. So who's here and there? Moro. Uh, the kaimono kaku, the shoppers, and others who are not quite shopping are here and there. Hi, what what do we have about the shopper? What are they wearing? They wearing he's they susunda on their body. Um, kata kakeni shawls. And uh, boro fuku, uh, which means worn clothes. Hi. Now, worn clothes and sh shawls uh, wraps around their body. Yeah. They got uh, worn uno. clothing and a shawl wrapped around their body. So we got a shopper that looks like this. And other people are where? Other people are here and there. Okani mo. Chirahora. Chirahora. Do you know what this bolded Chirahora. word is? The word for a uh, stick. Perfect. How do you Doro read it? Bo. Mm. It's bo. Bo. Hi. Bo. Perfect. Um, what's this bolded word? Ryu and then the edge. Hashi. Ryu washi. Not Ryu, I'm sorry. Uh, Ryo. Yeah, and it's the R, Ryo then Yo. Ryo. It's very hard to say that Ryo. as an English speaker. This could be like the throw in our vowels. Ryo. We don't really get the Ya Yu Yo's. Probably even harder if we go Ryo. 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 Both, ed, both, both ends. ends. Perfect. Yeah. Can you read this word for me? Con. Bo. Con Perfect. Bo. This is basically the same as just bowl on its own. It also means a stick. This tends to focus more on like a club or a bludgeon, right? Which bowl on its own is probably more generic than this. So this is for sure a weapon. Con bowl. Um, can you read this example hey, question for me? Kombo. Hashi no bashi de te ka wa kombo o matta. Is it matta? No, mot, mot, mot. Motta. I held the staff, not the staff, uh, the, the club, club. Hi. the bludgeons, um, with, uh, I'm sorry, it wasn't I who did it, it was the minions, it was, was it a minion? Yep. At the end of the bridge, Hi, at the edge of the bridge, the minion was holding the combo. He held, it was, he had, he was hold, he held a blood, a blood, a bunch of bludgeon, a bludgeon. <laughs> My goodness. It is a hard word to say. Bludgeon, I believe. Bludgeon. Oh, 
bludgeon you to death. <laughs> exactly. I'm I'm I've been the terrible I shall bludgeon you to death with my royal staff. <laughs> yep, yep. I mean that is what they do. That is what a bludgeon is used for. Ah, that's definitely what Khan thinks gonna happen. Um how do you read this uh, word? Okay. One line or something. Hi. That's it. Perfect. So how is it read without a Nietzsche? Ritz it by itself Perfect. mean example for so day is example and looks like this and that too is line so i actually also made this mistake and i was really confused i was like why is it not showing me line <laughs> which has the little hito so that one's ex so example and line are very similar so line and a human line is an example I made the same mistake as you so just, just the that's other day, that's probably yesterday. So it's not the same as Tatoeba. Hi. Tatoeba has de kanji right there with the hito. Hi. Any men? So, so. Hi, wakaru. Hi. Wakata. You should probably be done quick. Uh, what are the stall boost words? How do we read them? Uh, the first is yatai and roten. Roten. Hi, roten. It's a short roll. Let's go read this example sentence. Hi. Itoga. Yatai no my knee. Nagai. Retsu o. Kutteiru. I was making a long line for the people, the hito. They were making a long line at the front of the, of the booth. Perfect. Yatai no my knee. What's this bolded word right here? Mushi. Perfect. Mushi to ignore. Mushi. This guy shares a word with that. Can you read it for me? There's a kanji. Kanji. Hi. Kanji. Kanji. Where do I wrote that? Kanji. Kanji has Good that. Word. Seeing kanji means to monitor, to watch. Hi. Kanji. It ended with she. <laughs> what does it start with? Start with kan. Perfect. Kan uh, I'm going to skip that. Let's go read this example sentence. Ya tai no retsu no ashi de teka wa kan shita. The minion that was at the edge of the line of the Booth is um, making observation. Kanshita. I was monitoring, was watching things. So to make an observation is a different word. Like that's a hypothesis, right? This is to watch over, right? To observe, to monitor, right? This is what a guard normally does. Like they go monitor their surroundings or keeping a... They're doing um, hikaraseru, right? They all hikaraseru to have a watchful eye out. Um, what's this bolded word? Uh, this is nigi, higa, higa, higarareru. So this is just ni, nige, dareru, nigeru. Nige, 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 nige. This is nige. nige is to retreat. Yes, nigeru is to rare. run away. And nigeru is um to be able to run away cuz nigeru is a do verb. Gaku gaku is a sound effect word. 
that basically means like shaking, like clattering. In this case, like legs clattering together. Um, do you know what mitsukeru means? Takugaku mitsukeru. Mitsukeru, to find. Yep, to find. Perfect. So now you get to read our last line of the day. Mitsukeru, hi, hi. Higure, Higure no Kimi no Tega ga Yatai no Retsu no Hashide Kon Konbo o Motte Tanshi Shite no O Mitsuketa Tokiwa Hashio Ashida the minion of the Lord of Twilight. Uh, They were Kanshi Shiteru no O. Mitsuketa. Who Mitsuketa? That's the most important thing to make this easier to translate. Who Mitsuketa? Kanden. So I. I, I. At the Toki I found, that I, I found. At the time, what I've realized is what at the time when right. I found found what the um, minion of the Lord of Twilight was making observation that they were monitoring the place right. uh, while I was holding their legit the bludgeons, their clubs, their gangster type weapon here, Kanbo Motte, um, and they were at the edge. Of the line, it was at the end of the line, um, at, of the of the shopping cart, basically. Um, at that time, I, ashiga, gaku gaku shi, my leg tremble, and omowazu without thinking, I I ran I. You're correct so, that nigedasu means to run away, but why is there so ni natta here? Natta from Naru. Hi. So, so ni is, is like that. Mm. You're right that so does oh, oh, mean... No, no, no. It, it described the trembling that is like um the trembling of the leg that is like i want to run away that's a really good guess so this dashi so is like uh like appearance so kind of right like uh what we saw with omoshiro so nahon would be a book that looks interesting and so ni naru basically means like i i was almost about to kind of kind of like um Otosuru kind of idea. Without thinking, I was about to come to like run away. My legs were shaking and I was just about to do that. So ninaru. My legs were shaking and I was about to run away. Um, my leg was shaking and I was about to run away. Hi. Uh, Perfect. And that is where we're going to...